Hey guys, and welcome to something a little bit different. Today, I'm going to be playing Anastasia. I, I can't say that, I'm sorry. Anastasia. Anastasia and the Note Takers. I, I think that might be what it's called, but this is a unique, I, at least I think, I've never heard of this thing before. This is an original idea in Dreams that is actually almost a finished game or is a finished game from the last I played of it. I don't think it was finished, but it might be finished now. This is an actual insane, smart, really smart idea. It is basically he plays this little character here, who I'm assuming is Anastasia. I, I can't say the name, but I'm assuming it's that person. And you have the ability to use those things over on the left. They're basically like an extra jump or a boost. And that's where the mechanic actually gets really freaking cool because you can only recharge them when you're on the ground or no, you can't recharge them while you're climbing walls, but you can only recharge them when you're on the floor and it is, it is just a freaking sick platforming idea. You can also hold the button after you activate it and you can run, but that does not allow it to recharge. And yo, man, this is just the creator. If you are watching this, which I doubt, but if you are, this is an insane idea and I love it. It is awesome to see this. I've, I've only played a little bit of it, but man, do I love it. And is it so fun to play? Absolutely, yes. <laughs> if you guys want to get this dream for yourself, like always, the dream that I am playing is down below and if you do not have dreams yet what the heck are you doing the game is only i think it came out like three weeks ago now but everyone's starting to dive into it and some crazy creations are already getting made so you can expect in a bit of time they're only going to get even more crazy so if you guys want to get dreams for yourself i've also linked the game itself down below so you can go and play that um now remember the game does obviously cost money so if, yeah if you have the money go get it and there we go no note get and there we go. So I'm pretty sure that's what you do to finish a level. Now, there are only four levels, which this is why I'm assuming it's not done, because one seems to be finished and the other seem to be test levels. So what we'll do is we'll go to the actual finished level, just to show off what this will kind of look like. And might I say, this is just awesome. This is 100%. This is just insanely awesome. I really like this and I can't wait. Look how big this level was. Did you see how big that was? Like, it is just, it looks amazing. In, in all honesty, I love the style of this game. It looks incredible. I don't know. Actually, before we jump into it, let's let's just have a quick look. These are how many people... Oh, whoa, yo, okay. Okay, this is how many people have been working on this game, and yo. Everyone, good job so far, because this is awesome. But Morning Yan, I'm pretty sure that's how you say it. <laughs> this is insane. I love this. This is hands down one of my favorite dreams so far on this. If you guys want to go check out some of my other dream videos, Link on the, oh, literally on my channel, not link in the description. But man, we have played a few good ones. And the one thing that I've always worried about with Dreams so far is everyone seems to be just doing remakes, which I can understand. It gets the game more exposure, makes it so if I made a 100%, it, unless this video wants to prove me wrong, if I made a video on this game, which I obviously am, and then made a video on Super Mario 64 remake, but it's only the first level, this is almost a, like a fully freshed out new idea. I bet that video would get more views. It's because it just gets more recognition. More people want to see that kind of simple stuff. Like, they want to see a remake of a game, which is why they're so much more popular. Whereas, I don't know, I might be an idiot, and this actually might be a remake of something as well, but that's why I think a lot of people are deciding to go with remakes instead of, you know, original ideas, like maybe this one. You know, I, before I get too into it, I'm just going to Google this to make sure. <laughs> okay, so, no, I, I couldn't find <laughs> anything on it. The only thing I found was a... Disney movie? It's going by the same name. It might have not been by Disney, but anyway, let's just get into this level. Look at this, yo. This giant robot's crashed into this building. I love how, with this level design, it's kind of telling a story in itself, and that's what I love about some games. I mean, it's also showing this giant purple crystal thing is getting powered by those, and I don't know if I'm meant to turn them off or something, but yo, look at this. And I can jump. Ooh. Kill it. Ooh. Yo, I, I freaking love this movement mechanic. It is such a simple in the sense simple mechanic because it's literally just a boost up for another jump or a boost forward but yet when you add the chance that you limit it and also make it a rechargeable thing that you can also add on to being like this oh being also the fact that you can hold the button man that this is so cool i honestly think this is amazing and as you guys see if you use it on the the floor into a boost you should oh come on oh damn it okay so you can't climb on that Oh, what? It sets me all the way back here? Or is that... No, it sets me all the way back here. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. 
I, I'm pretty sure there is a reason I actually haven't beaten this level. I'm pretty sure I keep dying on it, but that's that's fine. Let's just boost all the way across. Now, we know how to play this, basically, so let's see how far we can get. Uh, where is the... There, there's the thing. Okay, I know what I'm doing. There is also, obviously, as you guys can see, those collectible abilities. And, yo, wait, is that chain actually linking to the other... No, okay. Oh, it might be. It might be linking to that one. Yo, that's kind of cool if it is. Yep. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Oh man, I am really bad at this mechanic currently. Alright, let's try this one more time, and then if I keep stuffing up, I'm just going to cut. <laughs> so let's run over here. I, Man, I just love the animations as well. Like, this character... Like, yo! <laughs> Freaking cutesy as heck, and I love it. It's awesome. Alright. You know, let's go the safe route. There's a bridge over here. Let's, let's see if we can actually get across without dying this time. Go. But this was also one of the very first dreams I did play. I remember I downloaded dreams, and I was like... I really hope there are some at least experiences of like done games and stuff like that. So when I discovered this, I was like, yes, this is what I was looking for. This is awesome. And I'm seeing a lot of people are obviously making, you know, test test demos for like rigs and stuff like that. And those, those are insane. But when those will get put into a game, that's when it's going to be like game changer. Because a lot of people are saying, oh, this you can't make full-fledged games in Dreams. You can only make like a level or something. And that's where you are absolutely wrong if you think that. There are so many people, because if you guys don't know how Dreams works, I'll quickly show you why I'm here. Never mind, I can't. You can usually go to the world map, and that allows you, so when you make something, you can make one level, then link it to another level, and link it to another level. You can link, I think, almost an infinite amount of levels together. So technically, you could have a, a hub world that when you go to this portal, it takes you to this level. Then when you go for this portal, it takes you to this level. The reason it's just a lot of people have only done one level or so is because it does take time to make this stuff. Like, a lot of these games were luckily here for people to play because of the fact that the game... Ooh, oh, yes, okay, cool. Oh, no. Ooh, okay, because the fact the game had an early demo. Oh, sorry about that, guys. I actually have no idea why my video capture footage dropped out then. Literally, I was mid-talking, and I noticed it was out. I hope it wasn't out for too long. Um... Anyway, but like I was saying, a lot of these games, obviously, they aren't going to be fully fleshed out single games by themselves, because that takes time to make, and hell, it's very difficult to come up with original ideas versus already having something to go off, so I give people that make their own original ideas, I think they deserve amazing credit, and then people that also make remakes, hell, that's, that's an art in itself, but there we go. Obviously, I did... I actually did beat the last level as well. It would have been a weird cut for you guys then. I would have literally gone from one to another. But I did manage to beat the other level. And yo, wait, what's this? What's this? X can be used to jump to, to clear. Oh, so this is the tutorial, basically. Oh, man, this is just freaking awesome. I, I love this. This is so cool. Wait, what was that? What was that? What's that? Jump against walls to climb. Yes, dude. And I'm assuming it's now just showing us that we can jump to the rings? Yes, okay. Come on. Ooh. Oh, look at that. Okay, okay, okay. Now on it. Whew. I, now, I will, again, apologize. I'm sorry about the cut there. I have no idea. Because I use an Elgato game capture. I have no idea why it dropped out so randomly. Hopefully it didn't affect too much of the footage because I've had real bad luck with recording my videos as of late. I I really hope this one didn't stuff up because this one's awesome and yeah I just wanted to save my actual reaction because I haven't played this level or anything. So I just wanted to save my actual reaction to it to this video and yo there we go. That is it. Now if you guys want to get this for yourself like I said link in the description and go show this creator some love and support. Morning Nyan along with all these creators here like Man, that's that's the great thing about dreams. It's a community, and you gotta you can work together, or you can make stuff by yourself to make a game. And there's my time. See if you guys can beat it. I did I did walk around for a little at the end then, so I wouldn't count it. But <laughs> that is gonna be it for me, guys. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, let me know by clicking that like button. And if you wanna go check out some of my other videos, I play other dreams, and I also make Sonic and Dragon Ball and VR videos. So if you guys wanna go check them out. You know where my channel is. It's down below. Unless they've changed it and you're watching in the future, then I don't know where it is. <laughs> I hope you guys did enjoy this video. My name is Troy, and I'll see you in the next video. See you guys.